We have some new findings coming out from Russian scientists that embarked on this expedition in the Arctic to see if they could discover anything new in some uncharted territory. In areas where man has never been before, so to speak, on foot or by boat. They can look at the globe by satellite, but to actually go down to every single area is different. So what they've done is they've gone to this area near France, Josephland. And in, in this expedition, in these poorly explored water areas, they discovered several big and small islands. They also found new peninsulas and straits. They will name these areas after they're done processing all this data, but it took 5,300 miles in only 41 days in the Barents and the Kara Sea. So these are two spots up here that they've been going through thoroughly. And I've said this before, Russia has uh, over 40 big icebreakers, if not more. The United States has two and it's going to be years before they get the next one built. Russia's going to go to town exploring this area up here and tear it apart before we can ever even start to get into understanding what's going on up here. When you're talking about finding large pieces of land and islands that literally man hasn't set foot on in a long, long time, with all the mysteries to history out there, it makes you wonder what is on each and every one of these islands. So I'm sure they're scouring all this. Uh, the same thing goes for Antarctica. But down there it's a solid landmass. Up here you have all this water. And when they get into certain areas that they haven't traveled through, lo and behold, they run up on land. That on map, they're saying, hold on, these should not be there. Plus, if you try to get up near the northern area of this planet, you're going to be met by military from every single country. Maybe now people are understanding why China, Russia, and the United States are all committing troops to one huge world army under the UN. That's right. And vessels from every single one of those nations can be found around this area around the North Pole, and you will not get anywhere near it. They will not let no one. So, if anyone thinks that they can, I want to see the proof because there's been multiple expeditions launched by millionaires to try to get up into this area, into these waterways, just to try to validate some of the stories like from Admiral Byrd. And they were shut down each and every time. So, unless you're lucky in the military and you're passing by up through this area, you're never really going to have a chance or a shot at getting a glimpse at what's really up here. And I think there's a lot of treasures up here, as, as well with places all across the globe. One thing's for sure, Russia is capitalizing on this. I wanted to make note of it. And you never know what they're finding up there. And we're a long ways behind. I'll leave a link. It's been Dabu7. Eyes open.